back to my channel so y'all i'm here i'm back i know i was supposed to be here monday but it's okay my friend's birthday was this weekend so i had to just really put my focus into that and yeah so today i'm gonna be showing y'all my everyday makeup routine from start to finish and before anything if you're new to this channel hi sis welcome to my gang and if you're returning to, uh, if you're returning um welcome back Welcome back to the game. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. And I got some shit coming for y'all, okay? I'm always going to have some shit coming for y'all. I'm not going to stop. I'm never going to stop, okay? And yeah, stay tuned if you want to see this look, all right? Okay, y'all. So before I get into this video, I want to let y'all know I got a new mic. And y'all, this motherfucking mic did not connect to my camera. Doesn't want to adapt. How you do it? I don't know how you say it. Doesn't want to connect to my camera, hook onto my camera. There you go. So I have to use tape to keep the mic up there. But if y'all notice the new, the way I sound, if it sound different, then let me know. I think I sound different. I hope I sound different. If I don't sound different, I'm just going to take the mic out and just say fuck it. You feel me? But right now, that mic is taped to my camera. And we just going to hope it doesn't fall throughout this video, okay? Y'all see me with a bare face. This is my skin without any makeup nothing these are my eyebrows my eyebrows look really jacked up because i had did them and i just i fucked them up i'm gonna tell you <sighs> yeah i just got a i got a um email from al willis because i bought a hoodie from him and he just emailed me because my address something was on my address or whatever whatever but yeah so i'm about to start with my eyebrows and y'all y'all know you haven't seen me do my eyebrows in mad long i normally come on here with my eyebrows on but yeah, y'all, I got a new mic, and I hope this fucking mic don't motherfucking fall off. Y'all, I literally have filmed this video already, and I never turned my mic on. So the whole time, it was just literally nothing. Like, no sound, nothing. Like, this is my second time doing this video, and I'm just like... Yeah. But yeah, it's my friend's birthday and you know we celebrate her birthday. She got a little Airbnb. Well she got a big Airbnb. I'm not even gonna say little. She got a big ass Airbnb and we just lit this weekend, so I should have filmed it, but I don't think y'all will be interested in vlogs. If y'all are interested in vlogs, let me know please. Let me know if y'all want me to do some vlogs and you know, y'all want to see what I do with my life. Because my life is really crazy. And it's crazy in a really good way. I'm not going to say it in a bad way. My life is crazy in an amazingly crazy way. And I'm happy. Y'all, I'm very happy with my life. And I know it's going to only be up from here. You feel me? I also wanted to update y'all on everything. And let y'all know what's going on and shit with me so if y'all haven't noticed um me and my sister do separate channels and if you didn't know me and my sister this was actually me and my sister's channel before and you know we did videos together but then eventually we just started to be on two different type of times and she decided that she wanted to do her own channel and I knew that I was coming I knew that it was gonna happen eventually not in a bad way but I just knew it was gonna happen because she's she is her and I am me and we are two we're not we're exactly the same but completely different at the same time so you know for you two us both being on this channel will just it's just been too much like, it worked before, but as we got older, it was just like, okay, like, I want to have my own shit. And basically like that, like, we just want to have our own shit, you know? And, well, she just wants to have her own shit. I didn't mind us being on the channel together. But then also, I started to, like, bug her about doing videos with me and shit. And she wouldn't be in the mood and stuff. So it was just like, she was just like, I'm going to just do my own channel so I can move at my own which is understandable because me I like to get these videos in and out not in and out but you know let's get these shits going her she just wants to move at her own pace because 
that's just how she is. So, so I'm gonna link her channel in my description box and everything. And y'all go check my sister out. She shaved her head. So if y'all wanna see that video, go and watch it. Mm. And if y'all wanna know about my hair, this hair I have in my head because people been asking me all over Instagram. This hair is the Bayani hair collection. Um, a lot of people buy this hair. A lot of celebrities get this hair. Like Ari, she does. She gets this hair. Um, Lyra Galore, what my name is, she get this hair. I don't know. Get this hair. Like Arrogant Tay uses this hair on all of the girls. He does hair on. He uses this hair. Or they use like white label, but I've seen him use this hair most of the time recently. Recently, let me just say that. But yeah, I bought this hair. This hair was not cheap. It wasn't. It was very expensive. Okay. Yeah. All right. So now I'm gonna put my foundation on. I'm gonna use the the Elf Flawless Finish Foundation. I'm in the shade Coco. So I'm gonna pump. I'm gonna pump two pumps because these pumps are the full pumps. So. And then I'm gonna grab my foundation brush. I'm just gonna. But y'all, listen, this shit's getting tight. Am I the only one whose nose starts to run while they're doing their makeup? What was that? That was my phone. Like that shit is crazy. Like my nose always starts to run while I'm doing makeup. Oh yeah, and I already moisturized. My face, I had used the um, Clinique, the Clinique um, ID moisturizer. I think I'm going to get the cream one. I don't really like the jelly one no more. And I'm barely using this shit, so I think I'm going to get the cream one, though. I think I will use the cream one. I'm moisturizing my face with that. I don't really use primer. Only when I'm doing a full beat and I want my makeup to stay on all day. But, like, I didn't want to waste my primer because I'm not keeping this makeup on. Normally, I would prime, and I would use my, either my matte elf putty primer or the poreless putty primer. I'll put both of them together because I do get oily in my nose, my forehead, and my eyebrows. So, I'll use my matte one, and then I'll use this one for my nose as well in right here because I have big pores. So, I will prime. That's what I will use. If, you know, you're a primer girl, I'm not really a primer girl. I really don't prime like that, but now I do. Unless one, I mean, now I do when I'm doing like full beats. You feel me? This my concealer. All right, now I'm gonna use my other girl concealer in the shade Cool Tan. Oh shit! I need to get some more. This shit is about to be done. Gotta order some more. You feel me? And yeah, yeah. Honestly, like. I'm so happy about my YouTube channel. I'm just, the fact that I'm like seeing it grow before my eyes is what's pushing me more because it's like, damn, like I'm seeing it grow. I'm seeing that you, all you got to do is um work your ass off. Not work your ass off, but you feel me? Like just put in a, put in a work and then you're going to get your results regardless. Before anything, like you're going to get your results if you put the work in. The fucking battery died, whatever. But yeah, I was saying like as long as you put the work in, you're gonna get results regardless. I don't really put that much concealer up here, but we gonna put some here today, okay? But yeah, so I'm really proud of myself, and I'm seeing that I can really do anything I say I'm gonna do, and I put my mind to. Cause my mind, your mind is a powerful thing. I'm a Virgo. I live in my brain. That's where everything is with me. Like, it's nothing that I don't think about. I think about every single thing. So, once you put your mind to something, once I put my mind to something, and I know I, I'm telling myself that I could do it. Like, I could be these. I could be this huge YouTuber. I could be, you know, a motivational speaker for women and shit. Like, I want to do all those things. Because, I honestly, my friends tell me all the time, like, I give the best advice. I really give good advice. And I'm taking that shit and I'm using it. I'm making it a resource now. Like, me giving the, the advice that I give, I'm taking this talent I have and I'm about to put it to use. Because 
I notice and I recognize that yeah, yeah, absolutely right. Like I do give good advice and I really do. Like I know I know how to I know how to feel when people when people are coming from. Like I have this thing where I can put myself in other people's shoes and understand them. You know, and that's just always been me. Like I always put myself in somebody's shoes and be like, Okay, what would I do if I was in that situation? Okay, here, this is what you should do. Boom, boom, bam. Then they'll be like, oh, shit, like, you know, I probably am going to do that. And then they do it. And 95% of the time, if y'all hear somebody dog barking, that's not my child. That's not my dog, okay? He don't bark like that. My dog is bougie. Not bougie, but he's, he's himself. He's quiet. He ain't a dog that bark. Only unless, um, somebody knocking the door. But other than that, he don't bark. But, yeah, um, I was saying, I'm going to use my RCMH powder and but I already have some on the surface so I'm not gonna waste this but yeah honestly I like to give people good advice I like to give people advice because I just know that I know I mean know what I'm talking about like people be saying oh you, you know sometimes people really don't know what they talk about they just want to talk just to talk honestly I do give really good advice I be I be listening to myself and be like damn I need to take my own advice Shit, that was some good shit I just said. You feel me? And most of the time I do take my own advice. And if I don't take my own advice at first, eventually I will. That's just me. But yeah, with this baking shit, I don't bake, y'all. Y'all know I don't bake. I don't do that baking shit. That's not for me. Now I'm going to grab my NYX. Y'all already know the foundation powder. Stay matte but not flat, sis. And I'm about to contour slash bronze my face. But yeah, I want to put this, this YouTube shit ain't even about, um, you know, popularity and, you know, money. Like, this shit is something I love to talk. <laughs> That's me. And once I found out that this helps you with, you know, just have people to talk to. Because honestly, half the time, I don't be having nobody to talk to. I don't be having nobody to talk to, no. My friends, they be doing their own thing. They be living their own life. They were just like, why not start filming? You know? Why not start this filming shit and record these videos? And also, I really am, I really be putting people on the shit. Like, females, females always ask me, oh, where you get this from? Where you get that from? I like those shoes. I like that shirt. I like that jacket. I like that bag. They always ask me, where you get this from? So I'm like, why don't I just... And make a YouTube channel like recently. Let me tell you something. Recently, I got so many DMs about that blonde hair I did, and I'm just girls was like, Oh my god, I saw your video, and I just wanted to get a personal, I just wanted to make sure that if you think I should make it to hair, y'all, the hair is good, it's not bad hair, it's good hair for the price it is. You feel me? It ain't like no fucking $800, like this shit was $800, it ain't this. It's good hair for the price. You feel me? It's Brazilian on top of that. I don't really like Brazilian. I don't know who likes Brazilian anymore. But it's just good hair. It's something cute to have for a short period of time. Not a short period of time, like two weeks. I'm not talking about that. Two weeks, maybe a month. If you maintain your hair good enough, you can have it for two or three months. You feel me? Like me, I maintain my hair good. But yeah, like, it's good hair for its price, you know? Only thing I didn't like about the hair was that it um the lace front didn't fit me, but everyone's head is not my shape, so I can't tell them, oh don't get it because it ain't gonna fit your head. Your head is different from mine, so I don't know how it's gonna fit you, sis. But yeah, I'm about to be doing so much shit. Like I'm about to do a clothing haul right now, fashion over. So I'm done doing this video and doing makeup. Fashion Nova, y'all. I gotta put you on to some shit. It's a little small Fashion Nova. It ain't nothing serious. Because I, I don't really like Fashion Nova like that. Like how I like Pretty Little Thing. Because literally, I got so many bags of Pretty Little Thing. Like, oh my god. I was gonna do another Pretty Little Thing haul. But I was like, mm, nah, let me not do it. I gotta go. I gotta shop some other places soon. I did Fashion Nova. So I'm gonna do another haul real quick. And yeah, I'm gonna turn my eyelashes on now, y'all. But yeah, honestly, I was just talking to my friend about like um, manifestation and prayer. Like that shit is real. All you need to do is pray 
and manifest manifest and talk, talk your shit you want in existence because it will come to you and me and my friend she's a pisces we got we really got deeper into that shit and now we use that shit on a regular basis thinking positive always think positive of yourself never think negative and that was something i really suffered from and i really prayed and I asked god and i said god like i want to stop thinking negative of myself and down to myself and overthinking shit to the point where i don't want to do it no more because that's shit i do like if i want to do something i will overthink it so much that i don't even want to do it no more like that's how i felt about youtube i was just like damn like what if i don't really be successful on youtube what if i fly what if i waste my time and it never happened i'm just like i stopped doing it for a little bit y'all noticed that i stopped doing youtube then i started doing it again and i'm just like okay i'm not gonna be you know sucker about this shit like, i'm not gonna be down myself and, and you know putting myself out of it like i'm gonna do it and i'm gonna make sure i'm doing it you know the way i want to do it in the most positive way i can do it and i'm not gonna be thinking negative about nothing like i'm just gonna do it you feel me and manifestation is real i was gonna talk i was gonna say um that little that little that new rapper um smooth l he manifested his career if y'all go to his page right now, y'all can pause this video right now and go to his page. It's going to be like something with a heart. And he stated that right now he don't got that much followers. This was weeks ago. Maybe like, I don't even know. It was a long time ago. It's, I think it said like 67 weeks ago, something like that on Instagram. And he was just saying like, oh, like, I don't have a K on my following right now. I remember that shit like just yesterday. He said, I don't have a K on my following right now, but I'm... He said something like, I'm going to be a, the greatest rapper or a good rapper. No, I don't even remember. I'm bugging. Let me stop chatting. Let me go to it. He was like... He said, I'm a rapper and don't have a K yet on my followers. But I know my worth and time coming. Have faith in yourself, little nigga. And that was... How long ago was that? 64 weeks ago. And look at him now. That's a perfect example of manifestation. Like, believe in yourself. Manifest everything you want. Everything and anything you want. Pray about that shit. I need to put enough glue. What the fuck? Anything you want, anything and everything you want, pray about it. That's a, that's a thing. Prayer is an example of manifestation. When you want somebody to recover out of something, when you want somebody to just, when you want to pray for somebody, like your nigga, for example, you want to pray for him, make sure he good, make sure he always good. That's manifesting. You telling God that you want this and putting it into the universe, that is what you call manifestation. You putting it, you telling the universe you want this and you have to really believe it, you have to really feel it. And when you do that, the universe and God gives it to you. Whatever you want. Like if you tell yourself you want to be a billionaire, you're gonna be a billionaire. Jay Z used to always sing his song. He's the like, greatest rapper alive. What is Jay Z right now? Y'all feel what I'm saying? You have to just be confident. Be cocky if you want to. Like, tell niggas and bitches, like, I'm gonna be the greatest at whatever you're gonna do. Whatever you wanna do. You know what I mean? Like, I'm gonna be a lit ass YouTuber, to be honest. I'm gonna be one of the greatest YouTubers. For, like, everybody gonna wanna do a video with me. You feel me? People gonna be fiending to do collabs. I'm gonna be doing collabs with everybody. Everybody gonna fuck with me hard. Like, you know, I'm, I'm just saying this because I know this is what's gonna happen. Like, I know it. And my haters, they gonna wanna fuck with me too. Bitches that don't fuck with me, bitches that salty about me all the time, they gonna fuck with me too. They gonna wanna fuck with me too. Like, you feel me? Just tell yourself that, like, You got to. You got to tell yourself shit like that. Whatever you want, say it and put it in the universe and it will come to you in your hand. You, it's going to come to you even, it's going to even come to you when you least expect that shit. You feel me? That's when it's going to come to you. When you're not even expecting that shit. That's really how shit went. I used to literally be un, not financially stable. Like my finances... Two years ago, 
wasn't wasn't good like i could not afford the shit that i have now you feel me and i manifested that shit i manifested a better job i manifested for me to be always be financially stable beyond financially stable i said i'm gonna be beyond financially sta stable and i'm gonna be so financially wealthy i'll be wealthy in happiness peace love i'm gonna be wealthy in so many ways and yeah i found a good ass job and that was through my closest friend i found the job she gave me a she didn't give me a job she put me onto a job and y'all i've seen so much money that i've never seen in my life you feel me for myself like never seen this this type of money in my life and that was all because i believed in myself and knew that it was gonna happen and i was gonna get it that was it that was it y'all so manifestation is key get into it look it up if you don't believe me look it up and look up cases of manifestation that shit works and i'm gonna continue to do this shit today and now manifest everything i want everything anything it's, uh, it's a lot of people on it now they really on it now but i've been on this shit for the longest manifest what you want whatever you want okay okay but y'all basically this is a look this is a look my z bag must fix my hand whatever put some new on so you know do the whole shebang but i'll be right back all right y'all this is the finished look y'all um this is just simple every day told y'all and that's it and also first i'm gonna say if you're new to this channel hi sis welcome to my game if you're returning hi sis welcome back and i'm sorry i was supposed to upload on monday but i didn't but it's okay i'm here now and i love y'all thank y'all for watching my video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'm gonna see y'all later